Hi Cubies, here's Alexandra and welcome to another video. Sometimes it is frustrating, isn't it? You stare at your unpainted miniatures that are scattered about your painting table. You have half-finished miniatures you can't uh, force yourself to finish. And you don't find the motivation to do anything. Well, in this case I might have something for, something for you. We all know and love achievements in computer games. Or off on Steam or something like that. Uh, when you achieve something in a game, boop, a little achievement uh, plops up and hey, you reach that and that. Yeah, congratulations. And even on Twitch where I stream, uh, I have achievements to unlock and uh, goals to, uh, I have to strive for. And uh, I thought to myself, hmm, why don't we implement that system into our miniature painting? So, first of all, I will show you uh, my little achievement uh, palette. This is just a tiny little brainstorm. You can uh, obviously uh, imagine yourself uh, even more achievements for yourself. Uh, go nuts with it. This is uh, just the thought of it. So, um, my thought process was uh, the following. Each achievement here is worth one point. One achievement point. And um, when you want to buy uh, new miniatures, you have to spend achievement points. So that means uh, in order to buy new miniatures, you have to finish your own achievements that you settled for yourself. So um, here are some examples for that. Uh, achievement one, paint a mini. One achievement point. Well, yeah, gotcha. Then uh, watch and follow a painting tutorial, or read one online, or buy a DVD, or whatever. Follow a tutorial and uh, finish the miniature that is in the tutorial right after the tutorial. One achievement. Uh, paint, f uh, paint five miniatures. Another tutorial. Uh, try a new technique, like wet blending, or battle damage, or glazing, or feathering, or airbrushing, or whatever. You. Something that you haven't tried before, just try it. Uh, Paint it ten times. Here, the new technique that you have learned. Uh, then you apply it ten times. Finish a ten-man unit. Well, another achievement point. Paint three different skin tones, like uh, a normal Caucasian skin tone, uh, then maybe a dark skin tone, or an orc, or an uh, Urukai, or maybe a drow, or something like that. Um, make a scenic base. So, uh, normally you have here... Uh, those flat bases make something awesome. Uh, paint a character model. Play a game with no unpainted miniatures. Paint together with a friend. Get feedback for a model from a pro painter or something. Go on a stream and uh, well, ask the people there what they think you could improve. Then repaint that model with the improvements that they have uh, mentioned to you with that in mind. So. There are some uh, achievements I have uh, just pulled out of my knee cap, and uh, well, like I said, you can uh, make your own achievements that uh, you think are worth uh, achieving for, and striving for, and uh, well, if you uh, follow this achievement uh, guidelines and the points, um, then you uh, are one motivated to paint more, to uh, buy the fresh new miniature that is on the shelf. Oh, I don't have achievement points, I must paint. And uh, the other thing is, um, well, you don't spend that much money on uh, miniatures because you uh, always have to keep in mind your achievement points. <laughs> so, and uh, for those of you that uh, <clears throat> um, are not following me on Twitch, uh, well, you should, <laughs> but uh, here's something uh, for you, for a uh, little eye candy uh, that can happen on the stream. Right now I'm painting here uh, this guy's on stream, but uh, something like that also might come on the stream someday. This is uh, a little project of mine, I'm uh, working towards the um, how it is called, this uh, new painting uh, um, contest from GW that is almost like a golden demon uh, for all the stores and uh, when you win in the store then you get 
uh, your miniature gets sent to uh, uh, the Warhammer Day in London and uh, well this uh, was what I come up with here uh, this is actually the miniature that um, started this uh, whole achievement process for me because uh, I tried out some uh, techniques that I would normally don't use for example edge highlighting you see uh, the entire miniature is edge highlighted and uh, wet blending the entire armor is wet blended and then edge highlighted uh, uh, true metallic metal here on uh, the weapon and the uh, and the gold. Well, I hope you like this little uh, eye candy, and uh, well, maybe uh, this achievement uh, list is something for you. Until then, you're Alexandra. <laughs>